There's a long run to the turn in the Philly and Mare turf, but it is a grass race. So ground loss always matters, and there's a very big field. In this one, running style and rider's decisions will matter more than post position. Odaria has already developed a lot and is still not fast enough to be a threat here. Mean Mary has never gone back. Each figure was as good or better than the one before it, and that last one puts her in the conversation here. And again, Motion has been very good in these races. With lots of time into this, Mean Mary is very likely to pair up that last one, though another forward move would be a stretch after all that development. Peaceful is much better this year as a three-year-old. She ran horrible and heavy going, and O'Brien was so discouraged that he chose her out of all his fillies to put on a plane and come to the Breeders' Cup against the best in the world. He clearly thinks she'll run well, and he's been right a lot. This, this filly gets almost a point in weight, which makes her borderline contender already, and there's a decent chance she's ready to run even better than that. Rushing forward will be going slightly further than ever before, but given she ran a top at a mile and an eighth, it shouldn't be an issue. This great mare has gotten better with age, and has the best figures this year of any of these. Surprisingly, Chad Brown's turf runners haven't performed that well in the Kentucky Breeders' Cups. But Russian Foil has been pointed for this, and she is clearly the one to beat. Sister Charlie is, on her best from last year, the best filly in this race. But here's the thing. In her previous campaigns for Chad, she ran her best early in those campaigns. She's six now and her first two this year were just okay. Yes, he gave her a break to be fresh for this, but he did that last year, and she didn't get back to her best. We're not dismissing Sister Charlie's chances entirely, but we clearly like rushing fall better. Starship Jubilee has literally gotten better every year, and is better than ever at age seven. She's in the group just behind rushing fall, and with tactical speed, should be able to work out a trip from close up. This is a solid mare. Rushing Fall is clearly the most likely winner of the Philly mare turf. Starship Jubilee drew inside and gets a rider switch. She could get a great trip behind the speed and be the value in the race. Peaceful and Mean Mary are the others to use. We will let Sister Charlie beat us, and she might. <laughs> 